It was kind of epic, I won't lie. Okay, but what does gaming in the 2000s be like? One Piece. <laughs> what happens? Okay, I'm actually not going to say this on commentary. I'll tell you the punchline after. <laughs> Okay. Um, right, getting into the match. Yeah, gets hopping <laughs> right into this one. So that can doing uh about thirteen, not bad. But um, I just I did I did while the uh, the match was starting. I looked at the set record. Currently, Zach is up seven two. Now set records aren't everything, but yeah. as you said earlier, George, not a fan of Cloud. Can I blame him? Absolutely not. Cloud's, hey, Cloud's annoying. Yeah, but <laughs> keeping him on the ledge here is one of the things that Duck Hunt really excels at. And Duck Hunt doesn't excel at much in this matchup. <laughs> much, at, much at all. Right? now he's kind of stuck at ledge, and he just keeps whacking that can away. Oh, really weird uh, blade beam from Georgie. Oh, great, yeah. Good spike coming from Georgie. Good extension on the can. Fantastic. So Getting this... Getting first talk with such a yeah. good lead. Only 30% on him. Having, having this percent lead is really, really valuable here because Butterdog does not have to approach. He can set up his traps forever and live the 160 because he has to take no risks. Yeah. And that's one of the big, like, big bonuses that Dunk Hunt has. If he gets the first stock, he's gonna like he's gonna have a good time for the rest yeah. of the match. And his set play, while it's not the best, is he can cover a lot of stuff. I don't know, his set stage. play is pretty freaking good. It is man. really good. Again, it, I, I mean like not the best, not not because it's not that good, but because Snake it's on exists. Dunk, because Pac-Man exists. Yeah, Snake and Pac-Man. <laughs> Snake, Pac-Man, Steve, like Character's like, oh, Steve's yeah. not really set play. He's just building he, walls. No, but, but then he has setting up walls. fucking set play, bro. He is indeed like, he's setting up oh, he's, he's saying, he's just setting up walls. Speaking of set play, George setting up this can, setting up this gunman. He has gotten just, a lot of percent. Really yeah, good Holding extra center, being patient. Lap in percent, but Zach has the limit. He's got him off stage. Gonna go high. He could have gone for a uh, climb hazard there, but yeah. I don't think he was uh, too confident. Yeah, he wasn't confident nice enough. And yeah, oh, that's gonna be a great, great trade up by Butterdog. Yeah, fantastic up air. That was, that was nice. No. Butterdog reacting a little bit sooner than One Piece fan. I think if One Piece fan threw out that nair, he could have got the kill. Yeah. But or maybe like. Oh, I'm thinking of Smash 4. Yeah. I was gonna think maybe up air, but that yeah, would not hit. I mean, up air wouldn't hit right in front of him. I think no, up air no, no. would have hit actually. Yeah, maybe. Just based on because Butterdog had to fast fall his up air to hit, so I think he was above oh, him true, a little true. bit. True, true. Yeah, but, he's also lighter, so yeah, oh, good, Zach good dash attack. on the board. 31. percent I think if Zach plays this next next stock really like, well, this could still go his way. But Indeed. that is a that is a bit of a tall order, George. Not known for going in, even when he's down, really. Yeah, that F tilt, <laughs> really, really good option to explode the can without it hitting you as well. Great space by a One Piece fan. But so, Zach, so far, just 0-3 with, uh, with these limits. Either either got it and died immediately, or just yeah. kept throwing Randy Blade Beans on him. Not too sure what, the, what he's trying to get with those. George not going to go for the uh, downer so extension on the can. So whenever, whenever Zach going to hit the can, but George unable to capitalize, and now he's off stage. Ooh, Ooh, this, is a good, this is a good situation. But for Zach, oh. but oh, up smash not gonna do it. The eye is right, so he didn't get hit by the can by, by Zach. Now he's off stage, but in pretty good position. Oh, good down oh, air, or I mean wait. forward air. What am I talking about? But now, you know, he's got he's got butter, you know, well, well, he had Butter Dog in the corner, and it is cloud corner pressure, so yeah. that could have been a lot harder. I have decided that from yeah. now on, I'm gonna call any move that has a spike down air, regardless if it actually is. I think that's raw. That's kind of fire. <laughs> uh, and that right, butter. That duck hunt narrow at so, ledge. One small in thing about Duck Hunt Nair at Ledge, George was actually tweeting <laughs> about this earlier. About he was it, yeah. like, yo, he Duck Hunt Nair at Ledge. Ledge at this is broken. And you know and, uh, hey, he, was, he got a lot of percent. Get He's, this man a true. I mean, hey, hey, hey. Get this he man like, a true. He got like 100% in corner pressure. <laughs> not from not from projectiles, but from Nair. Yeah, exactly. And, and I mean, he got the first stock from it, too. But yeah, uh, Brother Dog taking that stock pretty, pretty taking that game Pretty dominantly for how their uh, set record has gone. Yeah. Going to game two, I think they're going back to PS2, yeah? I believe so, That's yeah. But uh, this is this is where One Piece fan needs to adapt. Like, he yeah. needs to not die at 30 first dog. He needs dog. to not do that back here. And he needs to not get keep trying to jump in and getting stuffed out by Can, because yeah. Can... Hey, you can, you can kind of tell that, like, jo the, um, One Piece fan's getting a little annoyed. Yeah. When he gets, when he gets annoyed... It's it's usually over. He can he's not like the least clutch person I know. When he's like not <laughs> I really I, I can name two northeastern students less clutch than Zach. Oh, true. Off the top of my head. Oh, get this man in. <laughs> <laughs> all right, all right. Oh, Blade Beam. Uh, first first limited of the set. But hey, he's got him in the corner. 
This is where he this is where he kind of needs to get this kill if he wants to take the setback yeah. and uh, stop. But uh, so percent momentum. percent lead now. This is fine for One Piece fan. Even if he doesn't get the kill here, he's got the damage. He can get a stray hit. And yeah, Ooh, good and there. Cloud, you know, with these really big moves, really big and unreactable moves. Yeah, he's kind of good at getting stray hits. That was really good by Butter Dog to just take the stage control. Oh, but, but up, the spot yeah. dodge up smash, gonna get the first dog. And oh, not traded right back. Him. Yeah, the can does save him. Oh, dude. Another That's can really should be death, though. And jab oh, by yeah, yeah. Butterdog, not going to connect. Really bad trade for, uh, for Butterdog. For yeah. One Piece Man there. I like that. I like this by Zach here, just charging the limit. Okay, that gunman's out. George really does not want to get blade beamed right now. He's yeah, like no. playing for these projectiles all to clank. And he gets the weak oh, down air, so it's not going to kill. But he turns it around. Must have, that might have just been a miss input. I don't think he meant to. Maybe. I don't know. Yeah, maybe he was like looking for air dodge. He's yeah. wait a bit, but he may have pulled the trigger too soon. Yeah, good back air though. 28%. This is a lot better for One Piece fan so than the 100% lapping that he had last game. Yeah, and, and all of a sudden he's up. in the lead. Yeah. Cool, great. <laughs> Dude, why do Cloud's aerials do like 20 damage? And then Can just does an additional like 15. It's yeah. nuts. But that I was know, I mean, I mean, for I know uh, One Piece fan is not complaining. Yeah. I will say that uh, Butterhawk is doing a really, really good job of specifically playing around Blade Beam here. Like, Blade Beam does not seem very good in this matchup when the Duck Hunt knows how to, like, avoid it correctly. Yeah. Because it will clank with any of those projectiles. Yeah, and he's kind of. Good up. I feel like Zach's kind of throwing out too many. I'm like, ooh, nice back air. Kind of yeah. got. Going to um, give him a good lead. Like, I'm honestly fine with Zach just not using the limit and just using it for, like, the buffed moves. Yeah, honestly, or just using it for the movement. But now that he's in the uh, now that he's in the stock lead, he can just charge limit, and Butterdog's not gonna be able to do a ton about it. Yeah, Good no, fare. he doesn't have to. But he's like he, he doesn't have to approach anymore, and Cloud does do a lot of damage. So who knows when uh, Duck Hunt, who kind of has a bit of trouble killing if he can't hit you with his uh, with, with his silly little specials, or doesn't get a. Oh, that was a oh, real. I think he's dead. No jump. He's out. Yeah. All right, last stock fifty to zero. That's not too bad for Duck Hunt. That was a really smart gunman by George. Really I really like really that. Really good gunman. Yeah. Yeah. No. He called him out. With, he called that jump all the way out. That and that's impressive. that's some damage. But Can does get hit back. Eight percent. Wow. I said some damage. I thought he took like eighteen. Yeah. <laughs> He's gonna down air him. Woo! Oh. But he catches it with up B. This could be Zach's game. But Butter Dog can take it back all the same. The he dog is, with the butter. He is the dog with the butter. He's a slippery. He's a slippery little. Ooh, man. mash is out. Good mash by Zach. <laughs> Butterdog got a little greedy there. Nice Ooh. play beat. That first okay. one finally little connects, trade. but trades for 63, and this is a That's good trade for Butterdog. Oh, that could have been it if he, he catches it the DI. He catches the DI, or a Butterdog catches the DI like well, like he does the correct DI, is what I'm trying to say. Very nice, very nice. Cause that could have been that could have been terrible for Butterdog. Yeah. <laughs> not too terrible for One Piece fan. Not gonna oh. not gonna DI the can this time, but uh, George not being able to. Not, um, yeah, and that's a tomahawk. One Piece fan might come off here, but that was a really good. Let's see, does he get the cross slash? He's, really go He's for going it. for it. <laughs> oh, and he gets it. Yeah. Nice, nice. Good call out Game by One three. Piece fan. It's, it's cloud. It's not really a call. Huh? <laughs> it was a call out. He no, called out the no, timing. I mean, no, not not like that. I mean like me saying it. It's not really a call out. Yeah. It's cloud. Cloud in the corner. And your opponent is at 140. Yeah. Your opponent well, is at 90, really. Well, <laughs> especially like Duck Hunt. He's light as hell. Oh, yeah, no. Dude, dude probably dies at 85 with that much rage. All right, yeah. game three. I think they're going right back to PS2. I didn't really see. PS2 is a gentleman's stage. It That's what I was saying. It makes the best games, saying. is all I'm saying. PS2 makes the best games. All right, well, going into game three, let's see. Um, uh, let's see who clutches it out, who wants it more, you know? Indeed. Oh, Zach, getting a little tricky right there. Good job knowing he had no true punish and not going for one. Very nice. I'm, I do like the patience, because, like, especially in comparison to game one, and even, like, the start of game two, he just kept trying to swat away cans, and he took, like, 50. Points. Yeah, exactly. The patience coming out from Zach. Honestly, he's really he's patient when he's really in the lead, and I think he carried that over from last game. He's just like, oh, being patient works, so I'm just going to continue to be patient. Exactly, exactly. I like the way you, I like the way you put that. But like, uh, he's gonna. Well, he's, he, he's losing it a little bit, but like, he has to do something. Exactly. He, can't, he can't just sit back forever. Oh yes, and better dog. Great usage of the can. Nice one, can um, get rid of that gunman with that down tilt. Yeah. Very good. Cloud uh, down tilt, super underrated move. That move is awesome. Yeah. And by awesome, oh, oh, calls out the can. That was Man, really oh, good. Oh, that was amazing. 
interesting. That was a really I'm saying fantastic line, so I don't want to switch it up. But uh, really good cross slash. Gonna get him uh, a pretty good lead. Let's see maybe if he can lap uh, Butter Dog in percent like game one. Oh yeah, but that that forward air is gonna connect. I think that's forward air. Forward air and back air look like the same to me. They're they're, they're pretty similar. Yeah, and that Nair, wow. Butterdog getting so much mileage off this Nair well, right I, here. I will say, Butterdog, if he's done one thing well this set, he has not let uh, he's not let uh, One Piece fan get away with the lead. Yeah, like, that is true. A stock down, lead specifically. Yeah, anytime he's down a stock, he usually finds the kill way quicker than, uh, at least way quicker than One Piece fan did in game one. Oh, that was really good by One Piece. Still putting on a lot of pressure. Very, very... Um, got a back up there, but... <laughs> So, yeah, this is a good position for Butter Dog. A very good position for Butter Dog. But very is... good. Okay. okay, stop. <laughs> but, uh, it is Cloud. It does have that? Ooh, goes for that Ooh. smash attack. But that uh, that down air does auto cancel. I like One Piece George hitting up. that can as soon as it got back air, so it yeah. didn't uh, fling off and try to. That was also a really good um, like attempt to yeah break oh, down air. Another extension. Gonna take that. Gonna. Um, but I wanted to point out how George used that can on the platform to, like, reversal the situation. Because he jumped off ledge. Zach's like, oh, I'm going to catch his landing. But if he lands on the can, then, it's then so either it's the worst case scenario for Butterdog, you get a trade. Yeah. And it's not going to kill him, even though can has a lot of knockbacks. Yeah, because he'll be ready to DI. Oh, oh and that's damage. Oh, oh, but the blade beam coming he out. He lives, he lives, Zach he lives. That's now has stage. center stage. This could be a stock. This could be game three last stock. Let's see. Up throw, kind of going for... That's more damage. Up Ooh! Ooh! Great nice, forward air nice, on the can. Nice, nice, Okay, last dog situation. 0 to 55, looking really uh, really similar to last game, yep. but just kind of flip-flopped. You've seen, you've seen Cloud build up all that damage, though. Like, oh, those absolutely. aerials, we were complaining about them. <laughs> can One Piece fan, like, use them to the best of their extent? Oh, oh. I... I, li I, I like the cross slash. Yeah. I like the it, cross slash, just going for it. Um, see if he can catch like him being a little too aggressive like if he tried to forward air i also think though like he can just save the limit like not using limit is fine in this matchup unless you have to read oh this is a really good situation for butter dog oh but he doesn't get he doesn't get anything he doesn't it. go for the down tilt oh, that no. i think would have just been the game great up by one Again, piece fan but now he has limit so he can. can go he can go high Choose oh, not to not that... to f tilted for it and butter dog is gonna take the set 2-1 Good set by both of our competitors here. All right. Okay. That was fantastic, but we have to go.